Good kitten internet. Although the kitten is trying to leave and explore my desk when he's not allowed to be on my desk. He knows he's not allowed on my desk. He is still a good kitten, though. All right. Keep raising up the volume because I'm listening to the playback afterward. Right, son? Right. So, let's go ahead and leave Kevin Sorbo behind. He's a conservative asshat anyway. Well, after his brain injury. And let's go back to the Frontier Village. You know, the perfectly normal village where absolutely everything's ordinary. Welp. Remember what Elon I had said? Yeah, it was about time for another Crimson Guard fight. Stop! You want us to stop? Then tell us where Ash is hiding. I know nothing. Then die. Hark! Grandfather! You'll pay for that. I was about to say the same. You shall pay dearly for the lives of Lando, Dallas, and Kurtz. Move away, Lena. We'll take care of this. Oh, okay! Back, back, run away! Loading screen? Huh, that's weird. Okay, so this battle is a little weird. Because we start surrounded. There's a whole bunch of Crimson Guardsmen over here who are level 29. But the idea is, you'll notice there's a button here. The button will raise this and flood everything out and you don't have to fight them. But then you don't get XP. And, you know, I like XP. Also, I need to check to see if there's anything hidden. We've already found everything that's going to matter that's hidden. In the entire game, that is. Um, pretty sure it's the entire game. Uh, do, 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 do. There are things hidden in here. There are two items. There's one. There's the other. Yep, it's the two cracked tiles. So this isn't great. So yeah, the rest of these enemies are level 25 makes things a little easier. But you know me, I prefer to kill everyone to get the XP. Sabina's level 28 and has hyper healing. Great. So Sabina can heal herself 12 times. Excellent. Um, what is our objective is death of Sabina. So we want to make sure that we kill everybody else first. We've got Crimson Warlocks, which have Magic Arrow and Rolling Thunder. We also have more priests who have extra healing because, you know, they needed more healing. Oh, wait. Hold on a moment. I remembered something really important. I need items. That was the reason why I went to Kevin Sorbo Village. I need to go to the shop to replenish items. So I'm going to go do that first. Orb. Eel and I used her orb. And honestly, maybe I should just... Eel and I, you get two orbs. I have tons of money, I don't care. Um, Sarah, you get two orbs. Um... Yeah. 
Oh, right, there's a higher up in the wagon. Oh, well, too late. All right, I'm going to pause the recording and basically fast forward. Be right back. All right, and we're back. Sorry about that. So, what I would like to do is defeat these goobers over here, because I can. There's no other reason for it. The only problem is this stupid shooter. I don't even know if... Well, first off, let's zoom to distant, get an overhead view, so I have any chance at all at seeing where my salamander spreads. I need to be one tile closer. Now. Well, at that point, I might as well go all the way over to here. Yep, that looks good. See, you're normally supposed to get that spell during this battle. I'm slightly higher level than normal. Neil and I is a pretty damn awesome mage, though. Oh, you don't actually two-shot them. Oh, crap. Well, this might be a little more difficult than I was expecting because that means that they're going to get healed up from the damn deacon. I mean, I do crap tons of damage, that does help. Get okay, any XP for that. Totally worth it just for the XP alone, but not what I wanted to have happen. That's what I was planning on doing. I was trying to do a phase shift, but I can only hit four of them with a phase shift. Because what I actually need to do is be over here. And that is not going to be viable. Because they can uh, basically reach me. This is the only other close spot that is safe. And I need to get to about here to phase shift? No, I need to get here to phase shift. Do you have any additional spells beyond healing? No. We're going to play Protect the Zohar. It's still worth doing this. See how much damage it does? 23. 102! And somebody's got an aura gem, right? Uh, was it you? No, it's you. Like that. All right. Die. Most number of kills ever from a single fire. 179 XP. Did Darius just level up twice. I think he might have. No, he leveled up once. And he's pretty close to leveling again. Yeah. Well, that just made things a lot easier. I don't have to worry about protecting. I'm still moving over here, though. And there's going to be a good reason for it. Um, although... You can't reach with Mystic Shield, can you? No, you need to be too closer. Because you're going to get arrowed. And I know it. Also, you're higher level, so I gain more XP this way.
Let's make you have to heal yourself. Or not. You know, that works too. Well, now I feel bad for letting that healer live. They don't have any area of effect attack staff back here, so I'm not too concerned. So how it goes. Hi, priest. Yeah, I thought you'd run away. So there's an event that happens in this battle. I'm really curious about what happens. Crimson Shooters going after... Oh, Hux. Okay. That could be annoying. Because I think both shooters can reach Hux. And that's why they're going after him. Yep. I should have thought about that. Oh. It's fine. He can heal himself. Hmm, that priest does nothing. Interesting. And the Valkyrie sits there. As expected. All right. Hot cartridge ram. We start on internal ram. Okay. So the reason why I'm curious, well, you'll see in a bit. So I'm going to shoot this person in the back first. Expect to get hit that hard. I know it's not going to help much, but you know, it's something. Nine. I gained 3 XP, yay. <clears throat> oh, derp. I should have moved Grog up against the railing so he doesn't get arrowed. Well, I'm going to be using Ash to arrow anyway, I suppose. I'm gonna get hit this time. Thank you. I should have actually had Ash heal him. No, because I want Ash to actually fight. Right. Oh wow, healing plus did not heal enough. That's not great. Take care of this loser. Oh, you're still alive. Well, that sucks. Well, I guess Heal and I is gonna have to take care of him. Dang, Crimson Archers have a lot of hit points. I'm used to one-shotting things. Spread Force, not worth it. I'm just gonna rum and fire. Could just Piercing Ray, but no. Might as well get some decent damage on the other Crimson Archer. Especially since I don't know who the Priest is going to heal. Probably both would be my guess. But I definitely need that Crimson Archer out of the way. Okay.
Yep, you're gonna heal yourself. That's fine. Yeah, it's a plus, so they're gonna heal you most likely. Ooh, actually, they might go after Hux. Nope, they can't reach Hux. Never mind, they're healing both. Well, poop. And those goobers are doing nothing. So, fun fact, you're actually trapped in here. I do have my reasons for doing what I've done, though. Attack the first. First got bonked. There's a pretty long range, but I don't know if that's a good idea or not. I'd rather not get too much closer. Yes, I know. I'm oh, this time I didn't get hit. I guess it was the elevation difference. I'm just going to have to waste an ultra heal. It sucks, but actually... Heal and I go this way. Let's get closer to Ash. That way I can ultra heal, including Ash. Because Ash did get hit. No, he didn't. Never mind. He bonked it. Never mind. It's irrelevant. Anyway, position heal thyself. And deal and I, I guess. That's better. Bonk. Die. So I can't push that rock uphill as far as I am aware. I will admit that I've never tried. Nope, can't. Did not let me. Circle. Gotta heal up Clint a little. And might as well heal up the only other person back here that's been injured. I have reasons for doing what I'm doing. Although I should have saved first at the start of this round, shouldn't I? Oh well, a bit late now. And that's everybody. Oof. You're stronger than I thought. And that's why. Sabina, I'm back. Oh, Master Kane. Those troops were in trouble. And Kane immediately goes. This is a problem. For some reason, I thought Kane arrived behind everybody, not in front. This is a major issue. This might be a reload and start restart battle. Because I'm pretty sure they can take out Hux. Well, you know, if they block like that more often. Yeah, no, Ox is dead. Ow. 
Yeah, that last hawk is gonna go after Hux in the back and dead. Yep, this is a reload. Youch! I must make a strategic withdrawal. And then healing cane. See what I mean? This is a problem. Oh, and they started being activated. Ah, uh, yeah, this is definitely a reload. And it's from two turns ago, not one. Maybe I just restart from the beginning of the map. Yeah, actually, I think I gotta just restart from the beginning. I think the better play is dealing with these Coopers. Let's just phase shift them. Phase shift. Our phase shift doesn't do as much damage as Zohar. Huh. That's weird. Because that was 95. A hey, shift. And that's 103. Eight points of damage difference for no apparent reason. 81. Zohar gains more XP than Neil and I about it. Oh yeah, I never checked to see if Zohar gained a new spell. Nope. Darius will finish this off. Aura gem. Because that is absolutely worth doing still. Especially with how much XP Darius is getting for this. It's nearly leveling twice. 179 XP. Because I can defend myself from back here. I don't have to worry about getting arrowed or anything like that. They might actually have to come to me, for all I know. Let's see if I can actually take out this stupid priest. For some reason, I thought that they started back in this corner, and apparently I was wrong. Okay, check out the priest. Okay, so there's no more reason to even contemplate going back here. I might as well line up against this wall where I can't get arrowed. going to bring you toward the back. Okay. I don't even know if they're going to move. They are. They can reach Darius from there? Oh, well, that's a problem. And Hux. Oh, they can... I'm not hiding behind that wall. That's the problem. Welp. That's gonna suck. I know it's on turn three, so I have a little bit of time. How are you not- oh, it's the terrain, that's why. I'm just going to make sure you're actually dead. I can take a hit. Oh, 
Honestly, I don't even think regular healing's worth casting now that I'm looking at it. Let's get some plus on. It's so little now. I can't reach. Can I reach from here? I can. Probably should have waited on that healing. So I'm going to get attacks back for almost as much as I take. And I bet the priest is joined to just heal anyway. Darius, as I would expect, because Darius is the squishiest, and you are, in fact, going to heal. And nobody else is going to do jack squat. I'm going to save at the start of this turn. Because this is still not bad. You know why it's not bad? Because I have two people in melee range over here. Really? Examine. We found more mithril. Please just die. Thank you. Honestly, the priest isn't really much of a threat. His back being turned is the problem, and he's damaged. I'm thinking maybe a perfect guard on Grog might not be the worst idea. How far can you get? Not far enough. Can I actually take out that priest? Yeah, I can. Ultra heal. I can hit Grog and um, Darius, and Diego's also injured, but not as much. This will work. I want to get my friends in. Which 
means yes, perfect guarding grog makes perfect sense. There we go. I think that's going to be my best setup. Push comes to shove, those three can hide behind the house. Let's go. Yeah. Sabina, I'm back. All right. Yeah, Kane cannot reach this turn. Neither can any of the guards. They can, but one of those will be eaten by the perfect guard. So I'm going to take an arrow hit and maybe one flyer. I don't even know if the flyers can reach. So I can deal with that. That's not that big of a deal. Nope, flyers can't reach. I'm fine. Okay. Oh, crap. I didn't realize the warlock could reach. Not great, not the worst. Okay. Also, there's no kitty there. Let's remove the kitty cam. Okay. This could have been way worse. It's not great, but it could have been way worse. How do I deal with this? So the Crimsons need to be shot at. Or the falcons. I cannot reach either falcon with an arrow, can I? Oh, piece of garbage. Okay. Just gonna have to slam into them. Thank you, Dolan, for being a good meat shield. I can't kill you in one hit because you're on 5% defense. Um, we need to soften some people up. Oh. Zoom. Distant. Neil and I? How many people can you hit from here? You can hit yes. I like hitting yes. Let's go. <coughs> Now I'm using Salamander. It'll help against the guard at the very least, and it'll soften up some others. Especially when I have Zohar go out and phase shift immediately after. 115 on the guard. Okay. Uh, you have to get to here to phase shift, don't you? No, you actually need to be over. Honestly, where Eel and I was standing. I guess you're going to stand here instead. Not the greatest. But if I'm planning on killing everybody, it's not going to matter. Phase shift. You have nine hit points left, damn it. I might actually need Ash to cast a spell. Which is unfortunate because I wanted Ash to kill things. Wait, no. I can have Sarah cast a spell. I'm gonna be in a really dumb spot, but I can do it. Let's do this right. Really dumb spot, but it's going to be worth it. So I'm at least damaging the others. I almost have the hawk. I think I can get take Kane out this turn. I am absolutely going to wake up some people.
this might still cause me to lose somebody. Because I don't have that many people uninjured. Oh! I can do the um, Supreme Healing. Yep, goodbye, Kane! Ah, Sabina, I must retreat! Kane, leave it to me! Alright. This makes things a little easier. Really wish I could reach with my archers. Oh, I can. That's fine. Because I'm going to do a supreme healing, so it doesn't matter. Die. Okay. I only have one archer left over there. Which I admit I am a little concerned about. Really wish I could Delta Mirage. I'm going to have to Eagle, I guess. It's some damage. It'll be fine. Eagles! Peck their eyes out! <coughs> yeah, you don't have anything useful. I'm just going to actually... Uh, these are all 0% anyway. Doesn't matter. I can't do anything about that archer. Everybody who has a ranged attack used it. Well, everybody except for Hux. And Hux cannot reach with Holy Lightning, so... Alright. Time to show off Supreme Healing. It's going to use up almost all of Hux's magic, but that's fine. We are fast-forwarding, because this heals everybody for full. This is the effect of the Soul Stone, I think it's called in this version, or Holy H2O in the original. I know I'm not healing that much, but the thing is, is that I'm healing the correct people that I wouldn't be able to reach otherwise. Well, actually, I might have been able to reach them with a Ultra Heal, now that I'm thinking about it. Oh well, too late now. All right, because we have to take two hits. I have to take a hit from the Warlock and I take a hit from the Shooter. Shooter's going after Grog. That's probably good news for me. Because Grog can take a hit from the Warlock. Oh, Warlock's going after those two with Magic Arrow. Okay. That's fine. Grog's taking another shot from the Crimson Shooter. That one is... All right, I think we've stabilized. None of the other folks are moving yet. Okay, I lived. That's all that matters. You die now. Probably gonna end up using a life orb on Hux. He's got one ultra heal left, but I can heal those three goobers, and that's fine. See, it was the trial that I ran out of magic on Sarah, but this time I'm definitely gonna run out on Hux first. 26 XP, nice. I don't think I can read. I am one square off of reaching, figures. Well, you're just going to move up as far as you can, then. For once, we actually have a relatively open battlefield. This hardly ever happens. Before I move you, 
I want... I did save. I want you dead. One of the two of you. I'm not going to be able to kill you in one shot. Might be able to kill you in one shot, though. Nope. You actually have decent defense. I'm surprised. I'm gonna get teamed up by archers. That's something I have to keep in mind. There are no more flyers, so my swordsfolk can just fly free at this point. Only one archer left. And honestly, if you target Darius with the archer, you're a fool, so. And Dolan, as usual, bringing up the rear. Alright, how are things going to go badly for me? I have two archers alive, that's my main issue. They're both going to go after Grog. Grog's out of range of the others, so I think I'm fine. Unless if Sabina can hit Grog. I don't think so. Oh, I take that back. Alright, you blocked the good one, Grog. Grog's the only one damaged at this point, right? No, Sarah's also damaged. So maybe I should have Sarah heal Grog. Grog needs to pull back for sure. How far can Sabina move? Okay, I need to start dealing massive amounts of damage. Can I hit those guards with Salamander from here? Yes, I can! Sweet! That's what I'm doing then. Oh, friend Sally! Sally Mander. Take out that archer, at least. 37 XP. That's fine. I know I'm horribly... Oh, bad. I'm horrible on XP balance right now. Okay. Those goobers are what I'm worried about. Obviously, where Grog is standing is fine. We'll give a definition of fine. Oh crap, I am out of MP. That's not good. I'm gonna have to heal with Hux. And this means Hux is going to be out of MP. And I can't hit both of them. Okay. Did I save at the start of this turn? I don't think I did. Nope, I can't reach. Here's the problem. There are two archers left. Those archers hurt. I mean, I know I'm saying the obvious, but... My flyers will become pincushions from two archers. How far can you reach? You can only get up to here. 
And you're similar. Okay, so anything this line is safe. It's not great, but I can at least get closer. Oh wait, how far forward can you go, Sabina? Okay, here is safe. Okay. That's where I'm going then. Honestly, if I'm going to end up orbing Sarah, it doesn't matter. Other than for XP. I only need to get one more closer, right? Well, I need to move closer first. Yeah, I only need to get one closer. That's equidistant. That would be one closer. I don't want to use a life orb. Out of healing on everyone except for Ash at this point. Which sucks. slightly. Make them come down. They're still gonna attack. They're gonna go after Eel and I. Eel and I can take two hits. Ah, they're moving now because I damaged them. Good. Priests are going to heal all three. Of course they are. Yep. I got them to move, that's the important part. You're attacking Sarah? Really? Ow! That's uphill, too. Huh. Okay. Well, that makes things a little easier for me to damage people. I can now phase shift. I'm planning on using Amen to get the other item, for reference. And I, how much MP do you have left? Ten. Clint is the one that has the item. Worth. Again, magic stones I don't mind using. Honestly, I should probably just stock more party members with magic stones. Ooh, 66 XP because of the leveling difference. Oh yeah, how separated am I? 25, 24, 25, 26, 26, 25, 25, 24, 25, 25, 26, 25. Okay, I only have two at level 24. That's not too bad. Honestly, I actually don't care. Maybe I should have just gone with a Roman fire. So if I move forward two, I'm fine. And can hit all of them with a Roman fire. But, uh... Let's go with Sally. Hey, 
And while it's not going to affect the priest that much, I might as well. It's free damage. Sally. And then Zohar is going to phase shift. And he has plenty of MP for it. <clears throat> yep, these goobers are going to get hit for lots. Phase shift should be enough to take them out, actually. Yelenai levels up again. She's now level 27. Apollo? What the hell spell is Apollo? Ah, so many new spells. I did save at the start of this turn, right? I don't remember doing it. Well, I'm saved now. Phase shift. Oh, I can't hit the... I mean, I can stand here and hit them, potentially. Yep, doing it. I'm pretty sure the guards are all dead from phase shift. By the way, phase shift. Okay, phase shift's done. 35. Oh, damn it. They have like nine hit points left. Damn. Ash, you're my only hope. Stand from upon high and cast the fire of rolling. You can only hit two of them that way, can't you? Yes, you can only hit two. And I need you to heal Eel and I anyway. Which will give you lots of XP. So yeah, you're gonna heal and I Eel and I instead, and everybody else is gonna go a bonkin. I've got enough people to go bonking everywhere. Die. This isn't a great spot for me. Die. quite dead. Damn. These have a high chance of guarding, so I'm a little concerned. Shouldn't have been. Can I have like two MP left or something? One. Our meat shield. Got it. You are dead. Okay, level up. And unfortunately, I can't reach the stupid priest, which means the priest is just going to heal themselves. That's everybody. Sabina is the one I'm concerned about. I mean, I'm still concerned about the Warlock as well, but Sabina is definitely the one I'm concerned about. That shouldn't do as much damage to her as others. Oh, crap. She is within Sabina range. Can't even full heal. Uh -huh. Yep. Damn it, I didn't even notice that she was damaged. Well, I'm going to have to reload. Hmm. 
<sighs> grumble. Grumble, I say. Grumble. Still not as long of a battle as the trial. Yeah, it still makes sense to pay shift from here. Make sure I'm facing the right direction, that would help. Pay shift time. Again. I don't know why the oh I know why I'm doing less damage because they're on defensible terrain. Yes, Sarah is injured. I need to remember that. No. We're going to move the direction I tell you to. Like that. Heal up. <laughs> Which means maybe I shouldn't even bother with the priest. Just gonna heal full heal anyway. Same mass. And you have magic stone and a life orb. I didn't realize I still had a magic stone on you. Well. Would have been nice to know. Maybe I just use a life orb on Sarah. Because then she can actually take two hits and be fine. thousand I don't particularly want to spend that money but you know <laughs> not exactly a great spot for a flyer right next to boss archer at least got rid of all the guardsmen so now I only have two offensive enemies left, and the Annoying Priest. Sarah. Yeah, you have two MP. You can cure a status effect. I think you need to hide at this point. Packing Sabine doesn't do anything. I might as well do nothing. Oh, wait. Oh, if I would have realized I could have done what I'm about to do, that would have worked. Oh, well. Curb it is. Curb. Curb. Not magic. Item, Magic Stone, Self. Hey, son. All right, that should be a better turn. Warlock's going to hit two people. Okay, that means not gonna be able to kill anybody. Or maybe, might be able to kill Eamon. As expected. Can you kill Eamon? Not when I block. 
All right, I think we're good now. We are saving. Go murder a priest, please. Thank you. Oh, that was foolish of me. You can reach that column, can't you? No, actually you can't. Never mind, that wasn't foolish at all. Totally planned it the entire time. Um... Bonk. should have let somebody who had less XP do that. No, actually, both snipers level 25. Never mind. Dolan, you're gonna be the one that starts approaching, along with Clint. Two of you are lower level. You're gonna approach from up high. off an ultra heal. Oh, I can't actually heal. Oh. Well. And it's worth healing Grog, because Grog's actually within range. And I have one more ultra heal left anyway. Ah. Bonus decided to start running around like a chicken with his head cut off. So the usual. Can you reach? No. How about here? Can you reach from here? Nope. You know what? You have enough XP. Seriously, you're level 27. Oh, I wanted to see what Apollo was. Oh well. Give him a distraction. It's free XP. Because I'm pretty sure she's going to heal herself if I hit her with an avalanche. Although, maybe not. It only does 55. get the item next turn, and then Sabina can go bye-bye. Yep, mirror shooting, heal and I in the back. Eh. More free XP for whoever heals. Which is definitely not Sarah. At two. You're uninjured, so I'm going to have you pick up that scroll thingy! I picked up a magic scroll! Cool. Yep, yeah, we're going to stretch this out slightly. Apologies for running a little late. is 25 now. Okay. 
tempted. You know what? Let's save first. Also, there's a guinea. Because I am being ridiculous and silly. Of course not. I'm just curious to see if it even worked. I'm gonna try again. <laughs> you can't get away from me and Venom! Yeah, I'm pretty sure bosses are just the biggest satisfaction. Fairy Star, Eel and I, to get even more XP because there's a two level difference, thus that's totally worth doing. Yep. It's free XP! I might as well. Alright, let's get everybody else off of their line. Might as well do the last Ultra Heal. Get Hux another level, because why not? I forgot to see what Apollo did. Dang it. Uh, you have Shining Core. What the? So many new spells. I don't understand. You don't have any new spells. <laughs> All right. I believe Sabina will do self-healing. Yep. Oh, wow. Hyper healing is that large of an area? Neat. It's like an ultra heal, but not. Okay. What the hell is Apollo? Launch the enemy? I kind of want to see what this does. But I can look at it in another battle. Range 7. Okay. Training core. Attack magic. 30 MP attack magic? What the hell type of spell does that do? Now I'm just being petty. I'm basically just grinding XP from this and making this video still shorter than the previous one. star. Heal up Clint, just in case if she gets any ideas. She's not going to, but, you know, just in case. My last MP, Dark Star. I'm being ridiculous. Poor Sabina. Being trapped in a corner. Reminds me of what I do to, in FFT and throw rocks at chocobos in corners. Um, nobody else matters. <laughs> nobody else has any MP to gain XP with. I've gotten all the items on the battlefield. Nobody else can even reach. Sabina's going to heal herself again. It's free XP! Can you even reach this turn? Yes, you can. Okay. Well, actually, you have no XP eh, MP left, so just go over there. <laughs> Eel and I at least has one MP left. Okay, that doesn't matter either. Go over there. Ash has uh, five MP left. I can throw some eagles. Oh, 
I should have had Clint attack first before I moved somebody away. Oh well. Back, 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 back. So ridiculous, and I love it. Oh, and you finally get to do something! Kane, help! Oh, dead. You got 68 XP. Nice! Oh, that'd be one more, but still. Yay, level up. Everybody's 25 or higher now. And I found a rune arrow. You win! Bloop, 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 We killed Kane again. That's the second time we've killed Kane? Or third? Second. No! Don't leave me, Grandpa! Erosius! Ash, you were right. We were running away. We just wanted to turn our backs on the sheer massiveness of this power our ancestors created. But now we need to take responsibility for the sins of our forefathers. Grandfather! Lena, you must go to Orome Lake. Break the seal on the temple. You're the only one who can do it. It shall be reborn. The only power to resist the flames of judgment. The sword of destruction. Vandal Hearts. It is supposed to be Vandal Hearts plural. That is a translation error. Both in the Sega Saturn version and in, uh, like the unofficial translation here. And also in the PS1 version. But yes, we are finally name dropping the title of the game. Vandal Hearts. The blade is as fearsome as its name. The wielder has any doubt in his heart. The blade will become an implement of darkness and lead the entire world into despair. <coughs> Sorry, that's actually somewhat harsh on my voice. But Ash, I think you just might be able to handle it. I've known you for all of ten whole minutes. Oh, oh. Erosius, be strong. Tell them. Tell them for us. The people must not give in to power. Uh. Oh. Father! Thank you. Thank you. I'd like to credit my years of acting and theater experience for this lovely performance. Another death. Is there even any point to what we're doing? Sorry. Is there even any point to what we're doing? That will be judged by later generations. We have to trust our own conscious. Conscience. By the way, where's Lena? She's in shock right now. Elon and I is checking in on her. I don't mean to push her too hard or anything, but she's kind of the only one who can do anything, and she's like eight. We've got more plot. <laughs> Sniff! What am I going to do now? Grandpa's dead. All the villagers are dead. I'm all alone. Lena, no one in this world is ever truly alone. We're all connected. Me, you, the birds, the bugs, the trees, and even the fog. Ah, uh, you? Yeah. I don't have any family left either. And yet, I know I'm not alone. I have Ash, Huxley, and everybody else. 
<laughs> hint, hint. You too, Lena. You're one of us now. Really? You'll take me with you? Oh, yeah, of course. Here, take this pendant. Oh, it's beautiful. I was wearing it when they found me. I was an orphan baby with only this pendant to show who I really was. I'm giving this to you because now I know who I am. I'm me. Someday you'll know what I mean. Let's go back to the others, okay? Yep. Okay. And we finish out with a trail of destruction all around us because there's only two places left to go. I'm going back to Kevin Sorbo to pick up some items really fast. I'm not going to forget this time. Oh, wait, no. I actually do want to transfer items. Because we do have an herb in the inventory. What else do we have in our inventory? Um, I don't know what the Demon Stone or Royal Foil or... Yeah, those are the only ones that we don't know what they do. See? We still have the Fang that we picked up. Uh, I'm gonna give the Fang to a Flyer, except all the Flyers have stuff on them. Uh, Aemon. You're gonna transfer your Cure Potion to the Wagon. Wagon, you're gonna transfer your Dragon Fang to the Aemon. Who else has inventory space? Is it just Clint and Hux? Um, Hux, let's go ahead and give you one of the weird stuff. Like, I don't know what the royal foils are, so go ahead and take one, Hux. And let's pop into the shop. And let's buy a magic stone for Clint. And yeah, that's it. Also, we have that arrow that I'm going to equip really fast before I save an exit for the night. Weapon. Oh, or we have other things too. Oh, wow. We were ignoring things for a bit. Yes. Um, Dragoon Pike. We're going to give that to Darius. Weapon. Panzer Claws. I completely forgot about the Panzer Claws. Whoops. And we've had that for a while now. We have no armor. And Golden Axe is plus zero. Uh, those three we could just sell. Let's go ahead and sell them before I forget about it. There we go. All taken care of. Now we will save and exit, and I hope you have enjoyed this video, Internet. It's a pretty long one. Apologies, but I think it was interesting. And next one will be the final battle of the chapter. And I do remember it. It's an escort mission. Because yes, Lena has joined our party. Talk to you later, Internet. Bye!